So the pressure can build, the, the nerves can build we weeks, days in a, before a race. But, um, but yeah, once you're on the water, then you can relax. So when we overthink uh, how the perfect rowing should be, we, we can't really make it at all. The start is the most, the hardest point for me. And uh, uh, I always try to focus on the, the next stroke. Usually adrenaline is uh, fixing everything. It's going right the way it, it should be, usually. Actually, my head, I think, is empty in the start. <laughs> Maybe after 10 strokes I try to think about the rhythm, about the maybe stroke rate. I think first strokes are automatic for me. Most of the pressure uh, is on, well obviously at the, at the start, the start is really important, but also at uh, about 1000 meters you're starting to hurt, uh, your lungs are starting to burn, like really burn. And, then, uh... <laughs> and when it's really hurting, it's hurting in the race. I just concentrate on following the man in front of me and you know, setting up a rhythm or creating rhythm for the guys behind me and maintaining momentum. Of course, it's harder when the tiredness comes. It's really hard to control my technique and my movements. <laughs> if I don't have a good technique, I won't have a good boat speed. So it's all related. When Milda is really in good rhythm, um, it's it's much easier to follow her and, uh, I don't know, then I really feel that, oh, we are going so fine, so well, <laughs> it's so cool. <laughs> I rely on the people around me and I think that's what I love about rowing. You rely on the, the crew, the team around you and you don't talk, you don't talk. it's not a, a verbal sort of teamwork, it's just a movement and a feeling thing. It's yeah. like uh, when you feel uh, you just kind of have a sense that you're going faster than uh, the other boats and you just feel like for every single stroke you put in the water you gain uh, momentum. It's not a, 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 a physical thing, it's just a, a thing that you feel and uh, neck and neck in a race there's, there's nothing you can do, you just got to do what you do, you just got to get it right. Um, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't work. What, what do you say, do or die? It's like... Uh, and if you choose to go for it, it kind of, it kind of uh, well, the, both the pressure and uh, pain disappears because you're just in the, in the zone. Yeah.